Hey everybody, this is Tony Deligio with Plastics Technology Magazine. On November 10th, following two full days of presentations at Molding 2022 at the Charlotte Convention Center, the Polymer Center in Charlotte hosted a half-day workshop and tour. Leading the workshop was Suhas Kulkarni, top industry consultant and regular columnist for Plastics Technology Magazine. Kulkarni walked participants through melt preparation techniques, helping attendees learn how to optimize the melt in their process. For this workshop, time is split between a classroom lecture and hands-on learning at the press where a probe is used to determine the actual temperature of the resin exiting the nozzle and seeing how changes to machine settings impact that number. As Kulkarni noted, the quality of the melt and injection molding is one of the first major contributors to achieving a robust and optimized molding process. The settings of the barrel zones, the screw rotation speed, and the back pressures are all contributing factors that play major roles in the preparation of the melt. At various intervals, the class made note of those key parameters while also continuously sampling material from the nozzle via purges to determine what the actual temperature of the melt was in contrast to what was entered on the machine. I just can, I'm just going to use this to sort of preheat the, the probe right now. Okay. So I'm just putting it there. Let's see. The workshop was an extension of Kulkarni's Molding 2022 presentation, which led attendees through how they can generate their own material processing data sheets. That presentation built off a two-part series Kulkarni is completing for Plastics Technology Magazine covering melt preparation. Use this data for the next time I'm running the same material. I know that at an RPM of 200, I'm getting the 85. After working the classroom and at the press, the group broke off for a tour of the Polymer Center of Excellence led by its director, Phil Shoemaker. A not-for-profit 501c founded in 1972, the Polymer Center offers polymer testing and analysis, resin compounding and extrusion, and training courses for the plastics industry. You've got a hot barrel, you have weights at the top that um, push down on a piston, and it's really just gravity fed. We ran out the machine for about a day, we try to get as many samples as we can for that. Originally located on the UNC Charlotte campus, the center expanded in 1994 when a joint venture was created to form the Polymers Extension Program. By 1999, that program moved off of the UNCC campus and became today's Polymer Center of Excellence. In 2012, the Polymers Technology Center was created for small-scale production of resident compounds. Since then, the Polymer Center has continued to provide education, R&D, and trial production. 